Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kenya, and if this is your first time stopping by, please do not hesitate. Hit that subscribe button, which is right down there or here. I'm not sure which way it is, um, but go ahead and hit that little red button. And next to it, there is a notification bell. I will also love for you to hit that bell because it will help you out in the long run. But today, we're just going to go ahead and jump right into this video. Today we're going to be talking about another Fenty Beauty product and I am talking about, I know this video is probably long overdue, I've had this lipstick for about a few months now and I don't know why I did not um, <laughs> do a video on it, but I really want it before I just purchase it and immediately do a video, I wanted to actually um, wear it and see you know, how it really works for me. Is it really true to whatever it says on its website? So, on this website, FentyBeauty.com, it claims, this lipstick claims to be a weightless 12-hour liquid lipstick with a soft matte finish. Born in one head, turning red shade that looks incredible on all skin tones. I'm reading it directly from the website, guys. And, I must say, it is head turning. Yes, it is. Let me go ahead and apply this lipstick for you guys um, and then I will tell you my pros and my cons of wearing this lipstick. I'm going to go ahead and zoom in just a little bit more so you guys can see how I'm applying it. Key factor right now guys, I have only dipped once inside the bottle and that did the whole top lip without me having to dip again. I did not dip again and I believe I can still go again, I believe I can still do the bottom lip without dipping anymore. I really do. Let's see. Look at that guys. Guys, look at that. I did not dip in that bottle a second time. I'm literally using the same amount that was on there from the very beginning. Look at that. Guys, look at this. Look at this. I only, I'm going to keep repeating this because this is the key factor. I only dipped once. Once, okay? That right there is perfect. And I do not feel anything on my lips. I do not. It's not... I scrubbed my lips before I did this video because to ensure that there is no cracking or anything like that, I do have lip I do have those lips that have a lot of splits and cracks in between. So I was like, let me make sure that I scrub my lips and do not have any problems in the midst of me doing this video. But I'm just looking in the viewfinder, guys, because this lipstick is just so popping. It's so popping. And I purposely wore white in this video because I wanted you guys to just solely focus on this lip paint, okay? This lipstick right here is awesome. I wore it about two, I think two or three times I wore it. The first time that I wore it, I got so much compliments. Like, just 
walking around and people were just like, oh, I love your lipstick. Like, your lipstick look really good. I, like, that's all. They didn't care about the outfit I had on, shoes, hair, my eye makeup. Nobody cared about that. This lady literally saw my lipstick while I was driving by. Through the, the, the windshield of the car, she saw my lips. And I was like, wow, you saw my lips before I even got out the car? Like, because she couldn't wait for me to get out the car for her to ask me about my lips. I was like, okay, like, this thing is popping. This lipstick is popping, but I really like it, guys. It's really, really pretty. So, as far as pros and cons, so of course, I already told you guys, like, the pros, I love it, okay? It's very, very bright. It's very on my dark skin. Look, look at this. Look at this. It's, it's, beautiful and I did not use any um lip liner I wanted to just use it just like this I don't really use lip liners a lot I'm really I'm not a makeup artist or like this makeup guru or anything and I don't really know how like I may do things and it may not be like in order I don't really use lip liners and I love lipsticks where I don't have to use a lip liner if I don't want to and this is one of the lipsticks that I would put in that category where you do not have to line your lips to wear this lipstick no matter what shade or color of your skin this lipstick is bomb and as you can see this should this lipstick should last a very long time because I just used it once today and all I had to do was dip it in there one time and I'm probably not gonna I'm probably not gonna use this lipstick for another week or two because I don't wear makeup every day for one. I don't wear bowl lips every day. So this is this is for any time of the day. Now I have to be honest, we're talking about the, the cons now. I have to be honest with this lip, it does transfer. The lipstick do transfer. This claims to have a 12 hour wear. I've never wore lipstick for 12 hours so I don't know if it'll last for 12 hours but yes it do transfer. Now what I would say is when you're putting this lipstick on, do not pat too much on because that was one of my biggest mistakes the first time that I tried this lipstick on and I put like two or three layers on which was unnecessary and it became extremely transfer. I was like what the heck, I was getting ready to return this lipstick back to Sephora. I, I couldn't believe it, I was like what the heck is this? Um, why is it transferring so much? If I drink a bottle of water, you'll see the lipstick on the bottle. It was just so embarrassing at first. So the second time that I tried it on, I was like, you know what, can you just try one layer? Let's see if this applicator does what it says it's supposed to do. And sure as heck, like I just showed you guys, it literally, all it takes is just one dip and it will do what it do. Like, look, I don't need to continue adding over and over so let me go ahead and do a little test for you guys on this paper towel here and see how well and see if it transfer I want you guys to see this is just with one layer will it transfer so here's my paper towel and this is all that comes off and this is the other side I hope you guys was able to see that, but that's what comes off. That's not bad. Um, let's do a, a bottle water test. Just opening this bottle of water and not bad. So that was not bad at all and as you can see my lipstick is still on and intact so I give this lipstick a thumbs up guys. Thumbs up. It retails, I forgot, I don't know if I mentioned that it retails for $24 at Sephora and it was not as bad finding this lipstick compared to the um, foundation and the other products so this lipstick was pretty easy to find in Sephora. Um, I'd say go ahead and grab it guys. I really give this product a thumbs up that's the end of this video i hope you guys enjoy please go ahead and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video peace